I'm Emma Crewe from the Department of Anthropology at SOAS, and I'd like to explain about a new network we've established. This network is called the Global Research Network on Parliaments and People. Our network encourages research on the relationship between Parliament and other people in society. To give some examples, we are interested in how elected politicians within democracies relate to different people in society, and that might be their constituents, it might be the relationship between government and civil society when parliament is making laws, it might mean the relationship between politicians and people in the media or social media, or between the institution of parliament and schools. This network is open to everyone. We're running the network with a team who are based in the University of Leeds and the Hansard Society in the UK, JNU in India, and the Enlightened Myanmar Research Foundation in Myanmar, and finally, Forum for Social Studies in Ethiopia. Our first major research program is called Deepening Democracy, and it's funded by the Arts and Humanities Research Council. This program's goal is to create opportunities for national scholars, activists, artists, and filmmakers in two politically fragile states, Myanmar and Ethiopia, although we would also like to encourage collaboration between those countries and their neighboring countries. In this program, we're offering grants, but we're also finding ways to offer support to applicants. So that might be training, it might be mentoring from somebody either in their country or from another country, it might mean that we can give advice about, for example, international publishing. And really, we encourage people to let us know how we or our partner organizations in the, in the two countries, MREF and FSS, can support those applicants or grantees once they get a grant. We're interested in the relationship between arts and politics. We think that scholars working together with people in creative industries will find very innovative ways to ask difficult questions about politics, but also help us reimagine what democracy might mean in very specific places. Because we think that democracy should be able to emerge in any country in its own way. So we would really encourage people to join our network, to get involved, and to let us know how we can make it a really effective coalition of people who are interested in politics.